Halo sahabat Cao Cao kembali lagi kita menayangkan momen laga tinju dari Joshua, berikut 10 pukulan KO mematikan Anthony Joshua juara tinju kelas berat. Sebelum ditonton simak terlebih dahulu tentang Joshua. Anthony Oluwafemi Olaseni Joshua Obe, lahir tanggal 15 Oktober tahun 1989, adalah seorang petinju profesional Inggris, dia adalah mantan juara kelas berat dunia terpadu dua kali, setelah memegang gelar WBA, Super IBF, WBO, dan IBO dua kali antara 2016 dan 2021. Di tingkat regional, ia memegang gelar kelas berat Inggris dan persemakmuran dari 2015 hingga 2016. Again, Darts did well to take that. Darts is struggling. He's in trouble. And there is an arm. We should say that's enough, and it is. Because Darts wasn't going to go easy. But he was hurting, and he was hurting badly. And another clinical, brutal performance from Anthony Joshua. Skelton's Joshua looked to land the right hand, but he's taking his time and measuring it up. And that right hand did the damage. He just waited to pull the trigger on that right hand. And that little split second might have done for Matt Skelton. Because when it landed, it was perfect. Up at nine, is Steve Gray going to... Is it going to be another inside two rounds for Joshua, who takes his time, measures him up again. Skelton's all over the place. Steve Gray says that's it. Matt Skelton sinks to his haunches. He was destroyed by that right hand. He's done it again. Seven out of seven. Looking for the body of Joshua with a straight right hand. Joshua looking very sharp, and he nails it with a right hand inside the first minute. Cornish down, looking at his corner on one knee. Joshua biding his time, and then unloading again at Cornish, looking unsteady. Joshua looking to measure him up. Could this be gone in the first? He's caught him with another right hand, and Cornish is in desperate trouble already. The technique that Joshua is showing at the moment is terrific. You wouldn't believe only a dozen fights. And it's, it's all over. over. It's all over. Joshua with a couple of spearing jabs getting through. Another one of those right hands. The legs have turned to jelly. And he's ready to go already. There's another big shot. Another couple more. He's still standing. But for how much longer the legs are dipping again. He knows some tricks for a rookie. Oh. What is keeping Leo up? He is getting tattooed here. And he has to go, and it's over. That's what the fuss is about. A higher class eventually, but this has been a special night for him, and I'm sure he'll be delighted for the way he executed the job. Terrific punch, and to his credit, Leo took a few punches like that, and he's taken this one, as you can see, and looking straight back. He came with a bit of ambition. Let's keep in mind, he has an unbeaten record of his own. So, I mean, he comes uh, with pride to put on a show, and he's done that, but uh, Joshua, different class, the jab that he can see. Past his best now, right hand comes through, and he's wobbled, he's shaken by that, and Joshua straight on him, and Sprott's in big trouble here. Joshua just teeing off, Is that and Tyler O'Connor says that will do it right there. Have been Stunning. That should have been a bit earlier, because Sprott was in big trouble. Goodness me! And the referee was he watching the fight, a referee now. Goodness me, he should have stepped in a lot sooner than that. I mean that shows you the power this man has, that the, the punch that caused the, the, the damage was all was partially blocked. And uh, Molina as he uh, got closer. Maybe he feels safer at this range, but Joshua, like the predator, is going hunting and he's going hunting now. At about eight, he's wobbly, and surely it's a matter of time here. Great work there from Joshua. That right hand found its way home, and we saw the effects of Molina does not want to be in here now. The fight's over. Stopped in the third round. Anthony Joshua defending his IBF heavyweight title in emphatic fashion. And just come forward a little bit.
bit more, trying to lead off with his southpaw right, look for the, the left. Got it! One hand on the floor, Martin looks into his corner as if to say, what on earth was that? Now he's looking at the referee, he's drawing a breath here, taking every second he can. But Joshua's had him on the floor and there's still a minute 40 left in this second round. And he's down again! And Joshua on the brink here strolls into the corner as if to say job done. And Martin looks like he's been wrecked. Destroyed. Over. Done. Britain has a new world heavyweight champion. The tempo of his own work. And that's what he gets in return, a three-punch combination upstairs that rocks the head back. And then Joshua goes to work and puts him on the floor. When you saw Brazil's head but not back by the punch, that's when you know he was really hurt. He didn't have the neck muscles that case for that one. Job's almost over. Can Joshua get the finish here in round seven? Everybody on their feet. Brazil fighting for his life now. Zambano. Yeah, he just pours the punches out. I'm not even sure where he'd get that knockout power from because Jab just snapping his head back and the combination. He nods, but he's already starting to come apart. He did go 12 with Shannon Briggs, but Shannon Briggs a shell of the fighter he once was. And a right hand lays him out beautifully timed by Anthony Joshua. And the count's at eight. This is done and dusted. It is his sixth second round win. You see that he's got some of the cobwebs. Oh, man. Well, that was Joshua hitting after the bell, and White not having any of it. White's lost control. White has lost control completely. And what's happening here? Everybody's in the ring. Everybody. I hope White doesn't want to get disqualified. He's a boxer. He knows discipline is required. And he threw several punches after the bell. Yeah, I'll give White because obviously the round when he hurt oh, the got him. Finally got him. Is this the breakthrough? White looking to hold on. And this time he is holding him like he did in round one. Rocked by that big right hand. Joshua looking to size him up. Gets another right hand through. White looking to try and hold. Lands a right hand of his own. Terrific response again from White. And he's in slip now. And as long as White returns fire once in a while. Which he is doing. But look at the legs. There's a grin from White, but the legs are betraying him, and down he goes. He's hurt. The way surely, he's surely no way up here for Dylan White. It's stopped. It's over. Dramatic and unbelievable at the finish. Joshua asked a lot of questions tonight, came up with the answer when it mattered, and it was a brutal finish. I think White's still trying and to White's get out. still in some distress. I don't think. I think he thinks the fight's still going on. Like he's trying to beat the counter. Well, they've, they've got the paramedics in there with the oxygen.